Hi, welcome to our videos. In this video, we are going to see a simple way of writing a Java code in the notepad and then we are going to run in the console. The scenario here is we have to write a we have to take a part of the string without using the substring. That means we are going to get the do the substring without using the substring method in the Java. Usually in the substring we use the method like uh, that a string dot uh, uh, substring of and we can pass the uh, from one to parameters like questions uh, like uh, from one to five we have uh, all over since I five characters if I want uh, for uh, that uh, H E L O is the allow. In this one, I will want only E L O means. Then you can pass one comma four means. It will cut off the string. But here the condition is, we should not use the substring in our code. That is the condition. So it's a very simple logic. There is different ways of which logic is there. I am going to write a more basic way. Here we are going to see the more basic way. Let's see. Actually, the code already returned in the notepad and keep it for us. See here, we are having the string hello world and an exclamation mark. Here, we are good, we are trying to cut this LLO only without using the substring method. So, what we are going to have, you know, I am just to declare the another string which is the final output will be. We are going to set up in this one, store in this variable. Okay. The string is a string and a new string is that. By uh, initiation, I give just the empty. And in this int as integer, I am using the start from equal to 2 and before equal to in before. It is not a end before. Uh, actually, it is a not the end, it is a end before equal to 5. We can use the end also. Okay, we can use this uh, end also. In the essay, you can use four here so that you can get it there still here from because in a small string as a character array, we can this h is the, the zero position, e is the first position, l is the second position, other l is the second position, and o in the sorry, the third position, o in the fourth position. That's what I'm given start from equal to two and end equal to four. And just we are going to iterate by each string. Here the method main method is the caret. Actually, in this caret is the will take the each and every value from this what the position is having. If you are given two, it will take from the take the e. If you are given three here, it will take the l. So we are what we are doing, we are going to iterate it. Actually, we are using the for loop, right? So in the for loop, we have which it by the start from that is two and a, Eight less than actually we are going to take from four so we can uh, we can say give it as greater than equal to also so here there is no end before so it's end only and i plus plus you are simple for loop actually so in the new string i am going to open the values in the new object okay so str dot caret i so here it will get take from two three four I is uh, first time two. It will take the e and store it in the new, st new string, and uh, it will take the third position. That is two plus one three. So again, it will store in the new string, and uh, three plus one four. Uh, the plus plus right. So incremental to four. So again, uh, the fourth position. What it is uh, the o. So it will store, take that value, uh, value of o and store it here. Okay. We have the plus plus uh, two. Uh, attach the uh, uh, upper the each values. It is appending with the values. So, but in string of characters, single single characters is taken right. So it will as a character char character. So we are converting it to string that value to make it as a string. We are converting string and appending this string. And then the system dot out dot print is there just to print the values what we have in the new string. So this is the simplest way. We have, have improved versions. We are in the coming sessions, we will see one by one. So now I am uh, save this file and save it with the uh, Java location. Uh, save the Java location means uh, my Java is in the uh, running in the users user folder. So I keep the file there. And uh, now I am going to compile it Java C. Actually, in a clue, if I save it, it will compile it, compile it, compile it, the code. 
but we are using the very simplest way so sample dot java here yeah. oh file not found so sorry the file name is simple dot java not sample dot java file name is simple dot java see it's compiled if any error you throw error here it's compiled uh if okay if i am here not giving any of uh, this thing a uh, semicolon just remove the semicolon so see if uh, error is what it will show see you see that it is showing right like this it will show but now you can keep the semicolon here control s i am saving it again i am going to compile it it's compiled come on now the sample class is a uh, it is created so now i'm going to run it java simple simple okay simple simple value is created so i'm going to run the simple not one actually the object class created with capital c should be that's what it is now we are able to see see in the hello world we take the position on two to four right so two to four two Second position, third position, because the position starts from zero, so we can able to see the output like yellow. Yeah, this is the simplest uh, uh, code what we had with the uh, simplest way of uh, uh, doing the code without using a substring. Uh, in coming session, we will see the output to improve the this code. Thank you. Thank you for watching this video.